The forest is home to many different kinds of animals, including Bandy and his friends. Thomas often stops by to visit them. But he's not the only engine who likes to go to the forest. Hello, Henry. It's nice to see you here in the forest. I'm just delivering some fresh trees to be planted. Oh, and I see Bambi's doing well. I am, Henry. It's very nice to see you. I don't you get to see you as often? That's because I have many jobs to do, Bambi. Working on the main line is very hard work. Anyway, I'd better be off. I have more work to do. So do I. Sir Top Man wants me to help Mavis at the quarry. Do you have to go? I'm sorry, Bambi. I do. Bye. <laughs> Meanwhile, Henry was ambling into Knapford to take a rest later that evening. He had finished his last job and was relieved that the hard work was all over. But just right when he was about to go to sleep, he heard a sound. It was far away, and it was so loud it made him shudder. <laughs> what, what was that? <gasps> that sounded like a gunshot. Gunshot? Oh no, 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 no. We need to go back now! I have a bad feeling about this! Baby! Watch it, Henry! What's that? There are hunters in the forest! Uh, hunters? Come on, we need to go and warn Babby and the others! Hey, wait for me! None of you have seen him, have you? I haven't seen him since this morning! Oh, there's Thomas and Henry. Maybe they've seen him. Hey, Thomas! Have you or Henry? We don't have time to talk. We need to get you out of here. There are hunters in the forest. H hunters? Yes, we need to get you all out of here. Quick, get in my cab. And I'll go and distract the hunters. Thanks, Henry. Now then, let's get you lot to safety. But Bambi's still out there, Thomas. We can't just leave him. My main goal now is to get you all far away from here as possible. Oh, I hope Bambi's okay. I'll come back for him, Feline. I promise. Bambi is all alone standing by a river, thinking of past memories, his mother's death. A tear streams down his cheek. The sounds of the gun seems to get louder. Oh, no, not again. Oh, excuse me. That, uh, yes? Is there something you want? I've just been hearing something that sounded like gunshots. Oh, didn't hear anything like that. You must have made her something. All right then. I just wanted to let you gentlemen know about some hunters that have entered the forest. I have a feeling that they're hunting the animals illegally. Don't worry. We'll give an eye for anything suspicious. Thank you very much. 
I hope Thomas has managed to get the rest of the animals out safely. Thomas arrived back at the sheds with his animal friends, which was a surprise to everyone else. Thomas? What's going on? Why did you bring the animals here? They're hunters in the forest. I had to do something to protect them. But where's Bambi? I'm going back for him. If I don't, the hunters might get to him. Who knows what they'll do to the poor fawn? Hunters? Hunting fawns? Thomas, you need to get Bambi out of there now! Those hunters are poachers! They're breaking the law! But poachers? Oh no! Bambi! I'll get my friend back here safely or burst! James, Percy, you two keep the animals safe. And Edward, go find Sir Topman and the police. I'm on it. Good luck, Thomas. Bambi was all alone in the forest. But not for long. Huh? <laughs> this one will make a good price of it. I will. Come on, we can let it get away. Someone help me! Oh, I wish my father was here. Oh no! Dead end! There. Nice and easy. We got it now. <laughs> I can't see. Hey! If you want my friend, come and get him! Thanks, Thomas! We're not done yet. Hey! That blue scrap veteran is getting away from our trophy. Come on! Trust me. All right, come on, not you. <coughs> huh? Hello, 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 and what's going on here? Oh, uh, we we came to clean up the engines. That's all. With guns, mm, a likely story. You two are under arrest for hunting illegally. Fuck 'em, lads. They are both good innocents. We were just trying to make some money. This is all a big misunderstanding. It's all right now. You can come out. Thank you, Thomas. Oh, yes. Thank you. <laughs> I'm very proud of you, Thomas. You saved all these young animals from being harmed. Well, I can't take all the credit, sir. Henry was the one who spotted the hunters. And I'll be sure to give both you and Henry special rewards for being such brave engines. Oh, thank you, sir. Bambi and his friends were safe once again, and Thomas and Henry had been given new coats of paint for their brave actions. Sir Topham Hatt had special security around the forest, so no one would dare try and hunt in it again. Bambi never lived in fear of hunters ever again, and it was all thanks to his good friends Thomas and Henry.